Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, and in today's video I'll be giving my review for Which Brings Me to You. Uh, this is starring Lucy Hale, and is it Alex or Nate? Uh, Nate Wolf. Um, and basically these two meet up at a wedding. Uh, they start to hook up in a coat, clo coat closet, but then they stop because... Nate's character, Will, um, basically stops it and says, you know, he's, he kind of, like, basically, like, he's, he don't know if he's ready for anything, you know, to do, you know, a relationship or of any kind, and, which for her, is just really just a, a hookup, you know, nothing's supposed to be serious from it, but, anyways, they end up, basically, from there on, just talking, Talking about past relationships, a lot of this movie is thing is their past relationships, seeing what happened in those um, from both side from both perspectives of their of what's happened throughout their life, and by the end of it, you know they they end up together. So um, the movie was fine. Um, uh, I thought Nate and Lucy had good chemistry. I thought there was some some good comedic moments in it. Uh, sound cinematography was really well done. I thought it was interesting. The movie being mostly shot, mostly done through flashbacks of their past relationships, and not really much them together. It was more them bonding that way. I will say that's the main reason why I stayed into it like I did was because it wasn't showing present time the whole time with them literally just talking. It was showing flashbacks. Yeah. I forgot you watched this with me. <laughs> yeah. But I still thought it was only a one time watch though. Yeah. Um, the movie though, it, it was it was a one time watch. It, there wasn't anything overly amazing about it. There was nothing that... that uh, wowed me or anything to make me say this was an amazing film. This is a film that I need to rewatch over and over again. Um, I did give it a three and a half. It was one of the be it was the best one that I'd watched in the uh, run of films that I had seen at that point for new releases. Um, but like I said, only by a half a star. So um, this is definitely one of those three and a halfs that typically three and a halfs would make my shelf. But this one just didn't quite make it. Um, so, but I think that's everything I have to say. Um, so, please come like, subscribe, hit the bell, be notified for our videos, and we'll see you all in the next one.